Hello, App Builders. Winter 2020 is here, and I'm going to be going over the hands on certification maintenance for the platform App Builder. Um, one thing to note it is cold where I am, so I am wearing my Darth Vader robe, and uh, let's get into this. So, this hands on is all about component visibility rules based on devices. So, this is really cool. You can set which components you want to see based on your form factor of your devices. So if you want people to only see a specific component on mobile versus desktop, then you can do that now and let's get into it. Super simple. If we're gonna do this on contact. Uh, what you'll do is hit the cog at the top right, go to edit page. And let's say that we want to show this component for our desktop users but not for our mobile so we'll come over to the right and this uh, set component visibility was added a few releases ago I think at least one um, but now they've added this new selection in here for the device and the form factor uh, fields here so if we wanted this to only show up for the um, desktop users we'll just go ahead and select, set this equal to desktop and we can see now we have this little icon at the it's the top right, but the left most of the top right. Um, that'll show us that there is actual component uh, visibility set in here. And then I don't know. Let's do let's do this for let's say that we only wanted this to show up for mobile users. Doesn't really make sense, but in the end, this is just a, a demonstration. And then let's activate this, save everything, assign it to both the profiles. You may not have to go through this if you've already done it. Um, but make sure to get that done. And then now when we go to news, we're not seeing anything because that that Twitter component is now being hidden. The visibility is gone, but we are actually seeing this component to the right. So if we logged in on our mobile phone, we would not be seeing this component to the right here and the Twitter component would be there. So that's a new change for the component visibility, adding that form factor really cool and helpful especially for those of us that are getting more into the new uh salesforce mobile app since that's been released recently with this release um and yeah so go out there and start building and making sure you're optimizing those pages the best you can i think you have all the knowledge you need to complete this assessment uh, let me know in the comments down below if you need any more help or anything else to go a little bit more in depth with this i'm walters 954 and remember, I believe in you.